Hey everyone, my name is Mehul and welcome to this video in which we'll see what fast refresh is in React Native and what it brings to React Native if you're running React Native 0.61 and above. So what React recently did is that they got rid of hot reloading and live reloading in the menu. So as you can see right here, we don't have hot reloading and live reloading anymore, but just enable and disabling fast refresh. Now, what do we mean by that? Well, we see that with fast refresh, you get both the benefits of hot and live reloading. So let's just go ahead and make some changes here. So I'm gonna go ahead and search for step one, which is this thing. I'm gonna add some uh, random thing. You can see it immediately pops into the um, output section, right? And I could just literally do anything. And it's, it's pretty stable under the hood, right? So another thing which is good with fast refresh, which was not something good with hot reloading, is that if you make an error, like any JSX error or something, your fast refresh code could recover from the error without you having to reload the entire app. So I'm just gonna remove this error, you know, and maybe just add another expression here. And, you know, if, you know, eight times two is less than 16, yes, no, anything like that, basically, stuff like that. So if you make any error fast, Fast refresh, refresh could recover from it automatically, right? And uh, basically it brings the best of both worlds. So to upgrade to React Native 0.61, you first have to make an upgrade to 0.60, which is a major upgrade. I have a video for that. You can see the link for that video in the description. And it's a pretty interesting, a pretty great update to 0.61. That is fast refresh. So yeah, I liked it. Um, pretty much open to upgrade all my apps to 0.61 and see how it works and yeah that's pretty much it for this video if you liked it don't forget to subscribe and thank you for watching i'll see you then in the next one